Okay, welcome to my uh, Servo Mate turntable controller. Uh, the turntable obviously is in the middle, and it's designed for wagons or small locomotives. Uh, it could be used for end scale as well. Diameter of the turntable is uh, 75 millimeters, and the overall sort of platform size is 100 millimeters square, and underneath it is a 180 degree digital servo, which can actually rotate up to around about 200 degrees. Now, on the bottom right hand side, you can see the Servo Mate electronic circuit board, which is doing all the controlling. And on the top right hand side, is some push buttons that I've just wired up for testing purposes. Okay, let's have a look at it operating. So, the first thing I'm going to do is I'll drive a locomotive onto it. And it's on track one at the moment. And I'll push track three, which will give it a full reverse. And you can see the LED on the servo make board operating. Now I drive the locomotive off. Okay, let's drive the loco back on the turntable and we'll drive to track two. And of course, one of the things being 180 degrees, you can't always reverse or turn the loco the full quits, you know, so. Um, you know, there's that one limitation, but you can get reversing out of it. Okay, we've got to track four. I'll have to straighten that track up. And we'll go back to track one. Obviously, if I want to reverse the loco and drive out forward, I would have to use track number three. Now, one of the things you will notice, if I say go to track number two, it will go past the track slightly and go back again. And this is uh, just taking up the gear backlash so that we can get uh, proper control of the turntable and accuracy and positioning. If I didn't have that in one direction it would not uh, take up the backlash. Okay, so you would have issues trying to get it to work every time. When the power is turned off the servo will stay where it is and when we turn the power back on it will do a bit small backlash and then drive to the original position which in this case was track 2 that was last used. So it always remembers the last position it was in, stop the servo going berserk, and it does a little backlash. Okay, thanks for watching.